Hey guys, doing there, Job Wise Jones coming right back at you. Six weeks self paced online medical assisting program. Six weeks, yeah, yeah. See here, it costs $1,215. Offered reduced rates at different times. What do they award you? A certificate, a medical assistant certification online, accredited by the NACB. National Accreditation and Certification Board. So during this class, you will take classes like medical terminology, medical billing, infection control, and more. You will learn how to process insurance claims, how to give injections as well as emergency procedures, and how to provide CPR. This course allows you to secure employment with a medical assistant certificate. However, St. Blank offer certificates in medical billing and coding. So what does that sound like to you guys, huh? Six weeks? Let's break it down, okay? Because I'm getting tired of these nonsense ads uh, targeting my folks here who watch me on this video channel here because uh, this isn't right, okay? It's wrong, okay? CMA program, six weeks. I would never hire a CMA uh, <laughs> Sorry, an MA, not even CMA, a medical assistant in a six-week program. I would, I would never do it. Never. Because I know it's nothing against that person. It's against their lack of training. And you will put the patient in the immediate danger as well as my colleagues as well on the floor. That I already know. Number two, a program that costs 1000 bucks. Hmm, interesting. Certification award is medical assistant certification online. I've probably interviewed on a board probably 400 times for 400 different med medical assistants. Not once did an MA come to me and say, here's my online medical assistant certification for back office, internal medicine, family practice, nephrology, whatever, cardiology, whatever practice there was. Never had that. Accreditation. National Accreditation and Certification Board. I spent four days researching this nonsense board, because that's what it is. It's not real. Well, it's real. It's not valid. It's not a real accreditation body. It's just some nice sounding acronym, National Accreditation and Certification Board. Sounds really nice. If you look it up online, though, why I finally found the source of it, it's a bogus accreditation the bogus acronym is completely bogus. It's crap. And so then it says you can uh, have medical terminology learning. Yeah, you can learn medical terminology. Med medical billing, yeah, too. Infection control and more. How are you going to learn infection control online all the way, right? And then it says how to give injections. Oh, this is beautiful. How are you going to learn how to give injections via an online program? For children, for adults, maybe for a diabetic adult, for an elderly adult, what gauges do you use? What's the color code pattern for tubes do you use? Come on. How are you going to do this, right? And then it says how to provide CPR. Okay, CPR is free in most places. You get them through American Red Cross, so it's not something you should be paying for in the first place, right? This is an actual ad, though, you guys, from an actual school that got closed down two years ago. This is another case of a for-profit school selling junk to people who don't have the information in front of them, who are not ready to hear the information, or who were just sold a bunch of crap because it sounds so good, right? And so this is another case of where I say you have to do your homework. Don't join any six-week medical assistant program that says they can teach you injections. That's ridiculous. Another thing, too, the CPR thing is ridiculous. And the acronym. So you would say, are you accredited? They would say yes through the NACB, and it would be months into the program. Oh, sorry, six weeks into this program <laughs> before you find out the NACB doesn't exist. Oh, it exists, but it's completely bogus. It doesn't accredit you for nothing. That's the kind of stuff I'm telling you guys about, okay? 
This is what I'm talking about. But having to do your homework before you sign up for anything, right? You just don't, you know, you, you want to buy a car like that, right? You make sure it runs, engine's good, transmission's good, what year, how many miles in the car, whatever. Same thing with your future and your education, right? For me, from JobWise Jones, maybe there's a good six-week MA program out there. I've, ne I've never seen it. So if you see one, you think it might be good, let me know about it. Until then, I'm not impressed whatsoever. Let's go through another one of these awesome little, little, little things here, okay? This one here says online education and training program. It's the four month program for $4,000 same certification, medical assistant certification online. Accreditation, none. However, certain programs are recognized and certified by industry specific organizations. That's a bunch of nonsense that they cannot possibly explain to you if they had to it's what you call word jumble is to make you confused oh we don't have accreditation but um there's several programs that are recognized and certified by industry specific organizations now we all know if you want to get your certification in medical assisting <laughs> you gotta pass a test for that right they say nothing about that here how to help you get through that testing they say nothing about training nothing it's amazing Nothing about training here, the course content, the funding. They're asking for, excuse me, they're asking for, I was going to say 4000 bucks, but I'm sorry, sorry. They're, they're asking for $3,999. I, I, I apologize, $1 off. I'm sorry about that. This is the crap I don't want you guys to step into, okay? I'm stepping in this crap first ahead of you to clear the crap out of the way for you. You could have a crapless path to becoming a medical assistant, all right? This kind of junk here gives people's headaches and headaches and headaches for months and years. This stuff is so bad, it gives people's Tylenol a headache, okay? And this is what I mean. These online ads are great if they're real. These two are not real. These two are just selling you crap. And they're hoping that for every 100 people who see this crap, 10 people buy the crap. Let's look at it, right? This one here, 4,000 bucks, right? For this course, right? So if you get 10 people to buy, buy this crap, that's 40 grand for, for your school. For the school to pay off the member now, it's a for-profit school, for-profit. So they get some of the cut because remember, for profit schools are, are provided by investors. That's why they do this kind of crap to you, you know? So be careful. Ask the questions. Are you accredited? Yes, I am. Please show it to me. There we go. Show me what body represents this accreditation. How is that supported? Hmm. What is your after school hire rate, after graduation hire rate? Oh, it's 80%. 80%. Show it to me. Show me that proof. Can I talk to a graduated person from your program who's now working? Right? Do you offer federal funding? Hmm? Oh, you have personal funding? That's great. But do you also offer federal funding? Right? What year are the books you, you hand out? Are they 2021, 2022? What year are those books? Because... It should not be older than five, but five, five years for the medical field, right? So what year are the books you're handing out? What are the hours? Your teachers, how are they qualified? Are they certified MAs? Are they nurses? Who are the teachers here to teach this class? Does your school have any liens against it? Any kind of, any kind of federal actions against it at all? No? Okay. So... Do you prepare people for an externship once they graduate your school as a medical assistant? Okay. Do you give certification testing help? Oh, okay. What is a percentage of your graduates who land jobs on black and white? I'd like to see that in black and white, please. You see, guys, you don't have to have the same face and hardness as I do. But those are questions you want to ask. Those questions have to come to the table, right? 
I wish there was a job wise Jones when I was going through this situation because no one told me nothing. I got hooked, line, and sinkered in my school. I just got lucky because I had a really good teacher there. That's all. You guys, people are getting frauded all the time for these things. You know, there are some really good MA schools out there, even for profits too. There's some really good for profit schools out there too. Just watch yourself though. Ask the questions, okay? If you're not sure, email me. I'm here, jobwisejones at gmail. Ask in the comments below. I'm here for you, okay? This is what I do. I'm here for you, okay? Let me know, all right? All right, guys, take care. Bye-bye.